I mean, I think this is an amazing opportunity for contribution to this debate from folks who have of all ages and from every part of the nation, if we possibly can, these nations, get people who really can contribute. And particularly, may I say, I think we need to have ideas from young people as well as the old practitioners like me. We're starting with a blank canvas. We can look deeply, we can look across sectors, we can look at some of the new industries, we can look at some of the minorities, we can look at the regions. We're completely free to operate and we'll try and tease out some of the drivers, not just in the old industries, not just in industry versus services, but in some of the new technologies and new areas of media and data that will drive the future, we think, of Great Britain. Economic foreign policy affects everyone across the nations of the United Kingdom and that's why this Commission will be sure to take evidence from a wide range of voices, not just in any particular nation or city but across the country and also ensure that sectors, whether it's manufacturing or agriculture or services, as well as representation from not just expert voices in one area but also influencers. Um, opinion makers from a wide range of communities can feed into the kind of policies that will inform not just if we think about trade and investment policy, sure that's part of it, but more importantly what is the UK's role in the world writ large? The country is more than just England or the south of England, so we're going to be holding uh, sessions in Belfast in Northern Ireland, looking not only in Northern Ireland but also uh, the whole question of the impact of change uh, or possibly Brexit on the Irish and Northern Irish economies. We're going to be sitting in Edinburgh, looking at what's happening in Edinburgh. We're going to be also holding a very important session in Warwick, Warwick University, because Coventry is, of course, one of the heads centres of the manufacturing in this country, particularly the Jaguar. So we want it to be not just London focused, we want to really take it away just from London.